I got popcorn, guys. Hey, guys. Uh, I've been... Let's just set this up front. I'm tired. <laughs> I just woke up, like, an hour ago. And I'm already recording a video, because I know I need to get it done. Um, and yeah, the main point of this video is to teach you people who want to know how to make a gaming video, or maybe a tutorial video, where your computer screen um, is in the frame, and then your face is maybe somewhere up in the corner, like some of my first videos. I'm going to tell you guys how to do that. And if you're not interested in that, then why, why are you here? Because you shouldn't be. This is kind of going to be... OBS Inception, if you will, because I am recording the video that you're going to see with OBS, but I'm also showing you how to use OBS. So, you'll see more what that means later. That's kind of confusing, but anyways. Um, let's just start how to record using OBS. So, let's go. Um, first thing we gotta do is go into Chrome. If you don't have Chrome, use something else, but Chrome's better. Uh, and just search up OBS, and basically you're going to click the first link, and depending on what operating system you have, you have uh, Windows, Mac, or Linux, click the according one. Um, I have Windows 10 in this case, you can see, so I'm going to download the Windows 10. You do want to get OBS Studio, which you can see here. You don't want Classic. Classic's alright, but o Studio is a, is a much better version. Okay, so that's downloading. Uh, once it's done, you're just going to double or You don't even need to double click it in Chrome, but you just need to open the file up, um, install it on whatever way your operating system requires. Um, it should be pretty easy. And actually, I'll say that the... You know what, the link to this site will be in the description if, if you want to get to it that way. That, that'll make things a little easier for you guys. Um, yeah, so once you get it installed, you're going to want to go into your start menu or whatever and open up OBS. Wait for it to load. I'm sorry, everything's going to be a little bit laggy because I am recording using another version of OBS. You can see right here, that's what I'm actually recording with, and here's what I'm going to show you guys how to use. So, yeah. Anyways, once you got OBS open, you're going to kind of be greeted with a screen kind of like this, and I'm going to show you how, using this, you can have your desktop screen and your face kind of in the corner, almost like the video you're watching now. So, let's see here. I'm going to I'm gonna remove this, because this is already done. Alright, so first thing you're going to want to do, ignore this, this is the setting I'm actually using right now, but you're going to want to press the plus, make a new scene, and then the sources you're going to want to add are all depending on what you want. So I actually need to, see here, this is my webcam, this is if I wanted to use OBS, I don't use OBS to have my face in there, I edit that in at the end. But if you wanted to do that to maybe Twitch stream, because you can do that with this software, you want a webcam, and in this case it has a little microphone on it too. So now I have a webcam plugged in, and that's basically all you need, unless you want a separate microphone. So, first thing you're going to want to add is a display capture right here. I'm going to click that, and let's say... Just name it. You can name it whatever you want. I'm just naming it Display Capture. And then uh, you can see here that now in this preview box it's capturing my entire display. It looks kind of fun. Uh, and if you want it to show your mouse, then you can check that or uncheck it depending if you want to see your mouse in the video. In my case, I do want to see the mouse, so I have that selected. And there you go. That's, that's your preview up here of what people are seeing. So the next thing you want to add is your, where is it? Oh, there you go. Audio input device. And what this is going to be is your microphone. So you can see here, you just open it up, click your microphone, problem solved. So now you can see while I'm talking, I'm talking into this mic, and see right down here, it's going up and down because it's capturing my speaking. So there you go, you know that's working. 
Um, next thing, and pretty much the last, you want to do a video capture device. And in this case, it's going to be the camera. So my camera is going to... There you go. My camera is really, really bad. It's a pretty bad webcam. But it's the only thing I have to demo with right now, so yeah, you're stuck with seeing it. It's less, I think it's less than 480p. <laughs> so, now I got that, and I can resize my face in the corner. So I can put it over here, because it kind of looks like I'm looking, when I'm looking at my screen, it looks like I'm looking this way. So putting it like that would make sense, and uh, there you go. Now you can have your face up there in the corner, um, and that works fine and dandy. So you can see that this is still going. Everything seems like it should be fine. You just want to make sure, and how you can do that is by pressing start recording. Um, and then I can't click it right now because again, I'm already recording, but it's just confusing. I can't click it right now, but you'll be able to click start recording and it will pop up a video file over here. Um, don't try and play it because that will corrupt it. But when you're done recording, this button will turn into stop recording. You can click that and then uh, give it a second to finish up and then your video file will become playable. Uh, once it is, there's your video. You're good. Um, other notes. Yeah, if you want to tweak some settings, um, I probably should have showed that before. Right here is really the only main place you want to care about. That's output. Um, and you can choose what format you want your video, if you want it to be an MP4 or an MOV or an FOV. I choose MOV just because I edit with iMovie. Um, but in your case, you may want to choose something else. Um, and yeah, the so stream section here, if you want, you can go up, you can look up a quick tutorial on how to do this. You can stream to Twitch using the same software and setup, so that's pretty neat. Um, I mean, that's basically it. You now know how to record with OBS. Now, always remember to do a test recording before you go and record your whole 20 minute video only to find out that your microphone volume was way too low. Um, you always wanna do a test recording and make sure everything's good and then go ahead um, and make your full video. So, I think that's about it. I'm sorry if I was sounding pretty complicated because again, I'm still tired. Um, but that is basically it. So thank you guys for watching. I hope this video helped you out in some way, um, <laughs> hopefully. And um, yeah, I'll catch you in the next one.